Hey lovelies, this is Vashti Rains, and um, I'm going to make a video today to kind of share what is a big thing that's going to happen in my life here. Um, I'm kind of new to YouTube, and I've been doing like different videos about different things. Um, but there is something that I want to kind that I want to share, um, not only just to because there's not a lot of information out here on um, the subject, but I want to be able to look back at this and look at my progress. So, um, first off, thank you for coming to my channel. Um, my name is Vashti Rains, Vashti, whatever you choose to call me. And um, I'm just excited about um, a procedure that I'm actually having done, which I think will happen on March the 6th. I actually go in on um, March uh 2nd, which is tomorrow, March 2nd, 2017, and I am going to have the Obera, I'm getting my pre-op work done for the Obera intragastric balloon. Um, this modality is used to assist in weight loss. So just a little bit about myself. I'm a 44-year-old married woman with three adult children. A cousin that I am her legal guardian, a grandchild whom I love dearly, and three dogs, and two businesses that I run solely by myself. So I can say that life has really, um, even though I really, really, really love my life, um, I'm, I need to take better care of myself. And as I've gotten older and I've gotten more um, established and settled, I'm not as active as I used to be. So therefore, my metabolism is not as, um, you know, is not working or functioning uh, to its highest potential as it should be that would assist me in my weight loss. So therefore, I've come to the conclusion um, that I need some assistance. While I am, or just a bit skeptical, or not so much ready um, for like the gastric sleeve, which I did do a lot of research, and I have two dear friends to me who are uh, who have participated in the surgery, and they have had much success. Um, at this point in time, it's just not what I choose to do. So therefore, um, I choose to uh, use the Orbera balloon. So basically, the Obear balloon is a um, silicone balloon that's placed uh, via endoscopy, endoscopy, I presume, endoscopy, endoscopy, through, you know, so it's placed through your um, mouth, um, like if you're having an upper GI, um, it would be placed in your stomach, it's a, a balloon. And so once they place the balloon in uh, through this procedure, which is called endoscopy, they actually inflate it with between 400 and 700 cc's of water. Um, it's silicone, so it doesn't, it won't bust or burst or anything like that. Um, it is, um, so basically it kind of, it works like the gastric sleeve or gastric bypass. It controls the amount of food um, that you are that you take in basically um, there is not a lot of um, information or there's not a lot of videos of people uh, who are uh, who have had this procedure done I think there's like 220 thousand people it has been approved by the um, FDA, but it's been out for approximately, it's just been approved by the FDA here in the States over the past maybe year or so, but it was, um, it's been in the UK and all over, like in Mexico and all that stuff for some, quite some time, over 20 years. 
Um, so anyways, um, there's, again, like there's not a lot of information on it. So I do uh, plan on giving you a lot of details. So I'm just kind of making this first video here um, as just, you know, the beginning of the blog. And then I'll make another one tomorrow after my pre-op appointment and give you all of the information on, um, you know, what labs I had to do and, you know, everything they told me, the medications and stuff. I know that I'll be on some free op medications because of the research that I was doing, I found that there was um, some nausea and vomiting associated with it. And everybody hates to throw up. So, you know, me being a nurse, I am quite familiar. And also being a mother suffering of hyperemesis, which even though hyperemesis has to do with its hormonal changes, but um, one woman actually described the nausea as that type of feeling as having hyperemesis, and she didn't even necessarily know the term. But uh, when, she, when I saw that video and I saw that, I was like, yeah, I better tell him about my issues. So anyway, uh, with that being said, uh, I also want to say like a lot of times people are kind of like ashamed and they don't want to tell people what they're doing to lose weight and they don't want people to know, um, you know, like the things and the struggles that they've been through. Um, and this video is just basically kind of reassuring myself and others that you don't have to be ashamed of, uh, you know, the things that, are, of what you are going through. Obesity is really a disease, you know, and a lot of people suffer from it. Yeah, it's like, well, I know, you know, well, you should be able to do it without using a modality and all that. Okay, I've done that. I was a, uh, I've kind of struggled with uh, my weight going up and down like basically all my life in 2002 uh, I began a, a weight loss journey and I lost 70 pounds with just exercising eating right but I was very very busy and my children were young I was working like two or three jobs I was single you know I was very very busy and you know I was just able to lose the weight like with no problem and to maintain and keep it off like but I was my life was like a robot and I wasn't necessarily you know enjoying my life well of course you get married you get comfortable um you have grandkids you travel the world and all that and you want to try all these delicious delectable foods and all that and you know that's basically what I've done and, um, I like, again, I love my life. I love myself now, but I think that it's important that I lose weight. And then with all the times that I've tried to do it before, I'm 44. So with all the times that I've tried to do it before, within the past four, three or four years that I've been married, I've been married for six years, but within that time, you know, it's like, eh, I need some help. Okay. And so... The Obera intragastric, intragastric balloon is going to be my help. Uh, and so I'm going to kind of walk you guys through my journey, you know, as much as I can. Uh, I'm really excited. And I will share uh, everything with you. Uh, what I'm eating, what I can eat. You know, if I love it, if I love the procedure, if I totally hate the procedure... Um, but I'm going to be as honest and as candid and as open as possible. And I hope that, um, you guys, you know, just bear with me, you know, and of course I'm new to making videos. So, uh, if you guys have any questions, you know, I'm not necessarily concerned about you subscribing. Um, but if you would like to, that would be great. And, um, you know. We'll just um, 
see how this thing goes. And I thank you for joining. I thank you in advance for joining me on this journey. And um, if you have any questions, just post them below. And I will be back on tomorrow to let you know how my pre-op work up went with the physician and staff. All right, you guys. I'll talk to you soon. Have a good night.